So, Tom, how was that? Um, I was actually very pleased with how he coped with the atmosphere. Um, he doesn't find the first phase easy. He never has. Um, and his changes are always a little bit hit and miss. And sadly today, they were a bit more miss than hit. But it happens sometimes, you know, to have him here is is an honour. Um, and we bought him as an unback five-year-old. So to have come the whole way, produced him, um, with my aunt Helen Kerry, who owns him, it's just being here is is an honour and we'll try not to get too disappointed about that bit and look forward to Saturday instead. What do you think of that cross-country course? Um, I think they've done a great job. I think the ground's brilliant. Um, I think you know you're at Burley, that's for sure, um, but that's how we want it to be. And everything is very obvious to the horses as long as you're on your lines. And it's a, it's a proper test, but it's a fair test. And that's, that's what we want as riders. And so I'm actually very excited to get out there and give it a crack. And you came here last year as the youngest rider, second time here. Are you feeling any more relaxed? Um, I've tried to come with a different attitude this year. Um, I think last year I loved every moment of it, but I don't think I quite let myself enjoy the, the Burley experience. I think I was very in the zone, which I obviously am again this year, but I'm trying just to let myself enjoy enjoy the bits around it and treat it as a privilege to be here, which it is. and take each phase as it comes but um, so yes I'd say I'm slightly more relaxed and I've tried to come here with a different mindset.